Hey guys, welcome back and today we are going to be doing a clash talk. So if you guys are, are new to my channel or you guys are not sure what a clash talk is, it's basically a video that I do every few months basically, you know, discussing and addressing a few matters, very, very important matters, whether it be in Clash of Clans or the channel itself or I don't know, whatever. So yeah, so there are three major topics that I want to discuss with you guys today. As you guys saw in the thumbnail of this video and the title, the three topics are first things first, I want to talk to you guys about Clash Royale. You know, Clash Royale is the new up and coming game for Supercell. I don't, and as you guys know, I really don't upload it daily. I upload it about once a week. So we'll, we will be discussing, you know, like how much we'll be uploading that stuff like that. And uh, yeah. So second thing that we'll be discussing will be Town Hall 11. As you guys know, I am basically a fully maxed out Town Hall 10 now. So Town Hall 11 is definitely going to be in the near future. So I'll be addressing that later in this video. And then the third and final thing that I want to talk to you guys about is the face reveal. As I know recently, a lot of you guys have been asking me to do face reveal and face cam and stuff like that. Ever since I've basically hit around a thousand subscribers. So I'll definitely be addressing that at the end of this video. So first things first is Clash Royale. So Clash Royale, millions of players are playing that game now. Before Global Launch, which is actually when I got the game, not many people were playing it, but now there are just a multitude of players from around the world playing that game. And that's why you guys can actually see it is very, very popular on Clash YouTube. I was actually searching through a couple of channels a few weeks ago, and I noticed like Chief Pat and Nick at Night, uh, Clash Gaming with Mo... All those guys really, they basically have stopped posting Clash of Clans. And guys, Clash of Clans is my bread and butter. This is the game that I want to play. This is the game that I base my channel around. Obviously, in the future, we will definitely be expanding. But, you know, Clash of Clans really is the game that I am looking to focus on at the moment. And, you know, I don't want to just start doing Clash Royale daily and then just never ever post a Clash of Clans video or post it like, you know twice a month something like that because that really is just not really what i want to do and uh yeah so this actually also kind of gets into the matter with other video games that i might be playing on the channel uh recently because as you guys know guys my channel obviously isn't called clash with duke it is called duke gaming so we have to do different gaming right and guys really the only other video game that i play besides clash royale and clash of clans would probably be minecraft i'd have to say it's just the only other game that I really play consistently, and, you know, if you guys want to see, class, uh, you know, Minecraft videos, tell me down below in the comments, you know, guys, I read every single comment, so just tell me what you guys are thinking in the comment section below. Also, tell me how much you guys want me to upload Class Royale. I can definitely do it more two, three times a week. I don't want to really do it daily. Because, you know, this video, uh, or this channel, as I said, isn't really, I'm not looking to completely move into Clash Royale. Obviously, I am a level 8, so I'm not really, you know, at the top of the trophy leaderboards or anything like that. So, yeah. So, the second topic that I will be discussing with you guys today is Town Hall 11. So, Town Hall 11 obviously recently came out in Clash of Clans about a few months ago. And, you know, as a Town Hall 10, that, that not really the best news that I thought for that update. Not really something that I really wanted. But as you guys know, we obviously have to upgrade to Town Hall 11 sometime. And I think that time is very, very soon. So I'm thinking that we do, and that we upgrade, probably in the next Farming to Max video will be us upgrading to Town Hall 11. It's a two week upgrade, so we'll definitely, for those two weeks, we'll still be at Town Hall 10 and be getting Town Hall 10 loot and be, you know, still farming up our walls and stuff like that. But if you guys actually look at my base here, you guys can see 40, 40 heroes, 200 level 11 walls. I actually think I have like 199 exactly. I guess I'll probably get 200 by the time this video is uploaded since I just need like 500,000 more gold for another wall. But you guys can see here, really just maxed out my traps. Actually, recently, you guys can see like level 3 Seeking Air Mines, level 4 Giant Bombs. I recently got those. And all the defenses are maxed level 13 Archer Towers, level 13 Cannons, you know, level 8 Tesla, stuff like that. This is definitely in late time for Town 11, in my opinion. So we will be definitely getting that very, 
very soon. So these, so yeah, in the next Farming to Max video, you guys can expect that Farming to Max episode 25 for Town Hall 11. So definitely stay tuned for that. I'm probably gonna post that on Thursday or Friday. I'm thinking, yeah. So the last and final topic that I want to address with you guys here, very very important topic, is face cams, face reveals, and stuff like that. So I know recently, ever since I hit a uh, thousand subscribers on YouTube, a lot of people have been talking about me doing, you know, when will I do a face reveal, when will I do a face cam, when will I do, you know, just all that stuff, basically, you know, showing my face. And I'll be honest with you guys, when I first started this channel, I really didn't plan on doing a face reveal anytime soon. Honestly, I kind of wanted it to be like a 100k special or 25k special, something like something, you know, really big like that. But I realized that there's really no point in saving it because, you know, vlogging, from what I see on YouTube, vlogging is a lot of fun. I definitely want to vlog for you guys sometime soon. I want to do face cams in my videos because, you know, you guys, I'm sure you guys want to see my, re my facial reaction when I, you know, like, two-star those uh, maxed out Town Hall 6s and Clan Ors with my 4040 heroes. You know, I'm sure you guys want to see that. And I know you guys definitely want to see me do a face reveal. So guys, this is what I'm thinking. So, face reveal, maybe, let's say, 1,500 subscribers. I definitely want to do it before uh, summer starts, before, you know, like, June. Because I, I, I want to vlog some stuff during summer. I want to do some face cams sometime soon. So guys, why don't we do that? So, 1,500 subscribers is probably will be our face reveal. Maybe not 1500, maybe if we get, I don't know, maybe somewhere or close to there, definitely within the next uh, two months, you guys can definitely, I promise that guys, within the next two months we will do a face reveal, and uh, yeah, so 1500 subs, I think that definitely sounds like a fair number for you guys, so if we can get, I think we're at around 1200, we are at 1200 right now, so if we can get 300 more sometime soon, I'll do a face reveal, and let's do it. So, so to end off this video, we are going to be doing the random shout out of the day. I I do apologize for forgetting that in yesterday's video. Let me just hop on my uh, thing right now. I do have a a, uh, a random shout out already chosen. Let me find the question here. All right. So the random shout out of the day. I'll actually speed up this replay so you guys can see it, and then I'll go to the players clan. Alright, so yeah, two star by balls on your chin here. Very, very solid. So the random shout out of the day goes to Simonator. So Simonator is in the clan Fatal Force. The clan hashtag is hashtag YPL9JLJY Fatal Force there. His in-game name is Far Superior. So let's find Far Superior here. Far superior so this is simonator and simonator asks what is your favorite troop least favorite troop and most useful troop so this is actually a very very good question by the way tunnel 7 max out tunnel 7 looks very very solid simonator and my favorite troop in the entire game um i would have to say wizards wizards i just find are very very versatile they're and you can use them in basically any attack strategy in the entire game they can work with Barch if you want to farm. They can work with basically any single war attack in the entire game. So that's probably my favorite troop. Uh, I'm actually probably maybe sometime soon we'll do like my top 5 favorite and least favorite troops in a video. Something like that. So next my least favorite troop. Oh, that's definitely hard. Huh. Let me think about that. I'd probably have to say... Huh, that's actually really hard. I probably have to say the dragon. I just feel that the dragon, I now personally for me, I do not have uh, level uh, 5 dragons. I actually have level 3 dragons, which are Town Hall 8 dragons. By the way, sorry, Simonator, because I know, see, you have mass dragon cooked up in your army camps. I'm saying that my least favorite troop is the dragon. I, I apologize, Simonator. But yeah, I, I just don't really like the dragon. I find it's not good for farming. It's not efficient for farming. I guess it is definitely viable if you have them level 5 for clan wars or, you know, or matchmaking, but I just don't like them. Half an hour for 20 space troop, definitely very, very, I guess, long to cook up for really no apparent reason. 
And yeah, so the most useful tube, I definitely would have to say, just like I said, the favorite tube would be the wizard. It's just very versatile, very, you know, you could use it in just a lot, a lot of armies. And yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed today. If you guys did, make sure you guys leave a like. And if you haven't already, make sure you guys subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow. So peace out. And as you guys know it, definitely clash on.